Hello, everyone, to a rather interesting one. Yeah, um, this is one I would see on your shelf often, but I've never, never really experienced. This is a very fascinating game. <laughs> I love a lot of what it's doing. Not everything works. Not everything is the best. Uh, but I appreciate what it's trying to do, and it has a unique feel to it that I don't feel like a lot of games can capture very well. Fair. Yeah, I've seen you play a little bit of this game. It will be interesting to see, uh, see how this goes. We're also trying a slightly new setup that might let us be able to actually hand it off. So that could be Yeah. Cool. Uh, to be upfront, this game can get a little rude at times. <laughs> and I don't really want to put Brendan through that. Well, I do also see that not only do we have uh, our main character, the caveman boy, but it appears we also have like non-caveman humans as well as pig people. And where did he pull that out from? Uh, <laughs> put a pin on that one. Well, they so, appear to have stolen his armband. Yes. Toomba is a very special lad. Well, I mean, he's got what? naturally pink hair, so... Yeah. And this is actually... pre-game. This is immediate... This is what happens just before you start a new game. Yeah. So we... there's actually meaning to that cutscene. Yeah, we were gonna see if we could just, like, hit the start button. Um... And then after the loading screen, get that same cutscene again. But no, you actually get another cutscene that takes place immediately after that cutscene. It is also extraordinarily short. Comparatively. Hey, after playing Pikmin 4, I'm just really happy when we get short uh, loading screens at all. Um, yeah. I, I really liked that game, but boy howdy, it had a lot of loading screens. Oh no. They weren't, they weren't terrible. They weren't like Digimon World 2 sort of loading screens, but they were still a lot of them. So cute little detail. You start the game midair since you're dropping from the sky. <laughs> All right. I've got pink hair. And you we've sure got do. a regular person. Never seen you They're around. All... They're like all regular people. Toomba's the weird one. <laughs> Yeah, they, they would have recognized if they had seen Toomba before. I like the dancing mushrooms, though. Yeah. I used to live here. It's changed a lot. Go to the small hut on top of the hill. Crazy old geezer. You should be able to help me out. I like this game already. <laughs> the writing can be interesting. Press up on the directional button, and this square button. All right. What's with the pink hair anyway? <laughs> Never mind. I don't want to know. All so, right. This platformer has pseudo RPG elements to it. It has a quest system. I feel like I should be able to interact with this. Who it may concern. Please stop stealing my mail. You continue your villainous acts. I cannot be responsible for what will happen. Mansion proprietor. I really feel like there's going to be like bees or something in this. So I'm going to tell you right now. Uh, there are two layers to the screen right now. That is in the background. How do I interact with the background? <laughs> You will get there later. So right now we have Brendan playing because the, the game doesn't start off too, too bad. The controls can take a little bit of getting used to, as I'm sure Brendan is discovering as of right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm figuring it out. Okay. Um, but you'll find that 
there's a lot to this world that... Including fart plant. Yes. Um, there's a lot of unusual aspects of this world that are actually relevant, where in most other games, you would just ignore it. Interesting. I know there's a guy in this tree. I want to, I want to, I want to get to him. Unless he went to the background. Maybe I cannot get to him. I don't know. Uh, try just jumping at the tree. Well, the yeah. tree is actually in the background if I'm looking more carefully, so mm -hmm. maybe I need to be in the background for that. Yeah, I think I need to be in the background for that. Heading off to the old man's hut already? The fog is so thick you can't see anything. Looks like we'll have to turn around. Do you have your dye your hair, or is it just naturally thick? <laughs> can't let it go. Never mind. I need my nature survivalist mail order catalog. Oh well. Oh, I can read this sign. Exercise routine number two, wall climbs. Press up on the directional button and the X button to climb on a background wall. Climb up the wall to explore. Oh. So I can just... Not that way, there's a fence in your way. Uh, all right. Context clues. There are specific areas that will let you do this. They're wanna... usually pretty obvious with it. Ah. Oh no, I feel bad. Don't worry, that bird was gonna turbo murder you. But I got a baby. Yeah. Come here, pig boy. Okay, so I know I can, like, grab the pigs like that. But I did see that I also have, like, a weapon. What? Oh, okay. I've Your got... menu. <laughs> okay. I got confused. Yeah, I, I do see that I also have a weapon. Yeah, you can try using it on them sometime. Hey, I could get up here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it, it can be, a, the controls can be a tiny bit squirrely at times. Okay, I can't just do that. Oh. Well. Yeah, you thought this was a platformer. No, this is an adventure game platformer RPG type thing. They, uh, they try to do a lot. <laughs> oh, it looks like I can... Okay, so I can, like, clear the grass. So that's neat. Yeah. And sometimes it drops stuff. I have a whirlwind. Furious tornado acquired. <laughs> Okay, but how it do is. I use that? Oh, you can just climb up from here, too. Neat. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Noted. <laughs> it is too slippery. I guess. I feel like this should be able to spring me up. No. Those are actually used for something entirely different. Um, there is a bit of backtracking in this game, we'll say. Interesting. I, I can just break through this. Okay. I thought that was the fog I needed to break, to be perfectly honest. Nope. That's just junk. And this is hell. I found a car. If anyone knows this game, they know what I mean. Tim. Why can't I get on the car, Tim? 
<laughs> because it's broken. Oh, unfortunate. No, I, I'd rather it stay broken, Brendan. <laughs> oh, the bird's so sad because I ate his baby. Alright, well, I guess I need to use the item. I still feel like there's stuff I didn't get in this area, though. This game expects you to do a lot of backtracking. That seems extremely destructive for what we're trying to do here. Toomba is not always the nicest of people. Oftentimes unintentionally so. I see. I mean, he is just a little caveman boy. Does he really know what he do? There is... Yeah, because there's a... Oh, this guy's back. These guys are all back. What the heck? So... Frog. Yeah. Oh, um, frog. Where's the frog? Come here. I acquired frog! Take me home! Um... Oh, he's just on me now. Okay. And now he's gone. Oh, did he, like... Oh. I thought he would just be like Yoshi, where he just kind of runs off and then you have to just come back to him. Nope. You cannot get hit. Oh. Wait, where am I? I'm swinging. You're in the tree. Oh, okay. How did I... Okay, so there's a branch I can swing on somewhere in here. I don't know how I got to it before. Okay. Hold up when you're trying to leap off. Oh, okay. The controls in this game are... I feel like there's a lot of trial and error here. There can be. Hello, monkey friend! <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. I haven't eaten all day and your pink here is giving me a headache. We got a hungry monkey. I've been you collecting sure apples. Do. do you want... Do you want an apple? Do you want a chick? Not quite. This tree is full of apples. Why don't you just eat those? Because you eat them immediately, Brendan. <laughs> like that. <laughs> yeah. That's what you just need to do, monkey. <laughs> they don't go into your inventory, though. Toomba's a little gluttonous for that. What if I give you a pig? <laughs> nope. You need to find an item for that monkey to make him happy. Monkey's gonna want a banana, and he's wrong. <laughs> this bird is gonna give me problems. Wee! Oh. Toomba yeah, did not he's like not too that. fond of that. Can I'm I'm trying to go down, Toomba. That's the car. That is the car. I'm not sure where else. Okay. You unlocked the foggy area, so you can continue right. I was trying to continue going right. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, I know. You fell off because you didn't jump. I need to continue going right from this way? Yep. Okay. Oh. Well, I think I just died. <laughs> yeah. Despite it being an RPG and saving, there is a life system to this game. Alright. Frog! Don't bother. Not a whole lot you can really do with it right now. But I've got the frog. You do have the frog up until you get hit. I see another chest that I can't do seem to do anything about. We got the chick. Okay, I can't really do much there. I can't cross by fences. We've learned this. 
You know, I was just trying to jump on these guys and do that, but that works too. Okay, and the fruit, as well as giving you points, does in fact heal you. Yep. As one might expect. Get the chick. Cool. Alright. <laughs> sure. Yeah, as you can see, the game doesn't exactly hold your hand. It's no. just your mystery. When I talk to somebody, press the square button. Okay. Yeah, it's just kind of letting me do things. I think I need a key for this, I'm guessing? Yes. Okay. Well, I've now found two things that I need keys for. Can I aim down? I don't think I can break that. Oh, I didn't see that one. Um. Alright. I don't know how this helped me. <laughs> it didn't. Great. Fantastic. I'm not... I'm sorry, Mr. Frog, but... <laughs> We're just not going to bother. There are higher priorities right now. Can I go into this house? I can. It seemed like I crossed somebody. Perhaps. Maybe, it was... Maybe he wanted the frog. I don't know. AP box. I think it yeah. was. So all of these like little quests we're doing and things we're doing... Those get you points. Can you swim? No. Oh. I can't swim. I thought so. Mr. Troll saved you this time, but next time you might not be so lucky. Can't go past the door here unless you can swim. Trust me, you're not up to it. Come back after you learn how to swim. You hungry? Why don't you take this with you? Oh! Okay. Well, we got... Bananas. I'm not controlling Mr. Turtle, by the way. I'm assuming the AP box... Yeah, it just wants us to have 100,000 AP to give it. Correct. I'm assuming. You have to get to a certain level, or a certain amount of points before some of these boxes become available. Yeah, it looks like there's a dude in there, but I don't see that I can talk to him. Well, you learned that pressing the square button is how you talk to people. Well, it just immediately moves me as soon as I enter here. Or at least it was moving me immediately. I'm trying to hide from you. Since you found me, I'll give you a little hint. To the right of me is a... Behind this hut, there's a pond. Go up the hill up there, you can meet this crazy old coot. He just seems to mumble a lot. Okay. When I first um... entered here, it just kept me going to the right, and then when I left here, it kept me going to the left. So, I was wondering if I couldn't even talk to him at all. Okay. Okay. <laughs> also, that pond is where the frog wants to go. Uh, I see. Okay. Frog. Frog acquire. <laughs> what? The plants slowed you down. They prevented you from jumping. I see. Okay. I'm pretty sure that pond is where the frog wants to go. Let's find out. I'll admit, I don't remember everything. Is this where you want to be, frog? It is. And we get two lives. Okay, cool, we need those. Also, those little signs you see, uh, those are save points, I believe. So you want to continue to the right. Well, I can turn in the banana quest. You can do that too, you're right. I swear, I'm not even trying to deal with these things. <laughs> Sometimes the game kind of tries playing itself a bit. 
Come here. I would like some food, please. I don't think I'm going to get it. Alright. I feel like I don't have as much agency as I would like. Can I oh. please? Thank you. Yeah. The other reason I wanted Brendan to start is to get a bit more of an understanding of what it looks like to con and how it feels to control Toomba. And how sometimes it doesn't always make sense. Yeah, um, I can I can tell you right now, sometimes controlling this little guy does not work the way you think it will. All right, monkey. I, I was honestly thinking that might automatically give him the bananas. Just because that seems nope. to be the answer for everything else. <laughs> this is an RPG. You gotta find your items. Hi, Charles. Teach you a trick. Press the square button and the directional button to run. Okay, that that's actually quite nice. I feel yeah. like that's going to put me headlong into enemies, but... Yes, absolutely. <laughs> A thousand percent yes. We... Um, the dash in this game is actually reasonably fast. Yeah, I, I noticed that. You actually go pretty quick with it. That... Okay, that threw me directly into the enemy. Like... I'm just saying. Yeah. That just put me directly into it. There is a unique gravity to this game at times. 